What's up everyone, welcome to Stockton. It's a pleasure to meet all of you. On this channel, we talk about stocks before they start blowing up. Say goodbye to chasing stocks at all time highs and say hello to making some money. So if this sounds like something you want to take advantage of, then hit that beautiful subscribe button and like the video. Now let's get to it. Before we get into the video, I have to say that I'm not a financial advisor. Anything I say is just my opinion and is for entertainment purposes only. Having said that, if I'm talking about a company, I'll let you know whether I'm personally going to invest in it or not towards the end of the video. But you should always do your own due diligence, so with that out of the way, let's get started. Hello everyone, first off I just want to say Merry Christmas to all those celebrating. I know this year hasn't been easy, so I hope today you were able to hang out with your friends and family. Today we're talking about NEO Technologies. Ticker symbol NIU. NEO Technologies designs, manufactures and sells smart electric scooters in the People's Republic of China. The company offers NQI, MQI, UQI and Gova Series E scooters. They have other products too, but I think you get the big picture of what they do. As you can see, it's currently trading at $28. At the start of the month, it was trading higher at around $31, so this could be a nice time to buy these shares at a bit of a discount. ARK Invest has been buying NEO shares for a while now and they recently bought on this dip as well. If you go over to ARK Autonomous Technology and Robotics ETF ARKQ, you'll find that they have just over 770,000 shares of this company. So whenever ARK Invest is buying something, I pay close attention to it. It obviously doesn't mean that it's a home run stock just because they're buying it, but I'm sure that you'll agree that their ability to research winning stocks far outweighs that of a YouTuber with 32 subscribers. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. Right, so next, let's have a look at the income statement to see what they've been up to. So as you can see here, the net income increase in September 2020 compared to June. They didn't do too well in March, but I think China was still recovering from COVID back then. Another thing that I'd like to look at is their gross margins. Increasing or high gross margins says a lot about the scalability of the business. Over here, we can see that the gross margins decreased but according to them, this is mainly due to a sales discount and higher sales volume for a model that has lower gross margins generally. So I don't think this is something to be worried about. So what I'm going to read next is what excites me most about the stock going into the next year. So I'm just going to read this from this article. Meanwhile, NEO also has been expanding into new international markets and will continue to advance its global strategy. NEO CEO Dr. Yan Lee commented, Southeast Asia will become an important market for NEO. In quarter, four, in quarter 4 2020. In quarter 4 2020, we plan to launch our new Gova product in, Indo in the Indonesian market. The marketing campaign and pre-sales will start from December 2020. In October 2020, the number of e-scooters sold in the international markets reached 2,275, which represents an 83.9% year-over-year growth. In November 2020, sales volume for the first 19 days has surpassed the total sales volume for the entire month of November 2019. NEO expects revenues of quarter 4 2020 to be in the range of RMB 565 million to RMB 615 million, which represents a year over year increase from 5% to 15%. So, as you can see, they're expecting good growth in the quarters ahead. Now, let's see what the analysts are saying about the stock and where they see the share price going. But before I show you this, it's important to note that analysts can't predict the future and they don't get their prediction right every time. So, take them for what they're worth. Okay. So this is a bit insane, apparently they're predicting that the stock will, in 12 months will be worth $275. That's an 876% increase. Do I think this will happen? I highly doubt it, but I do think this stock can easily 2x or even more within a year. Right now let's have a look at their balance sheet to check their debt position. A debt to equity ratio below 40% is considered satisfactory. So over here we can see that 19.2% is well below 40, so that's a good sign. NEO's debt is well covered by operating cash flow, 99.3%. That's another positive sign. This means that they shouldn't need external financing. And finally, they also have good interest coverage. So all of this looks good. One thing that I noticed here was that GGV Capital have been selling NEO shares in the past couple of months. GGV Capital is a global venture capital firm that invests in seed to growth stage investments. So I know it says insider transactions here. But GGV isn't an insider, it's a company that holds NEO shares and they're just selling. I don't personally think that this is anything to be concerned about. 
they could just be selling because they want they want to readjust their portfolio or they could be well there could be a number of other reasons if there was something major afoot ARK Invest wouldn't have been loading up on their shares like they have been doing in the last couple of months. We all know that EVs are the future and the hottest place for EV growth is China. The immense size of China and its huge population represents a massive target market. And currently e-scooters only represent about 16% of all scooters in China. And I'm sure you guys must have heard that China wants to go carbon neutral by the year 2060. So they're really pushing for electric vehicles. The growth potential is huge. I really like this stock. Personally, I'm not invested in this company as of yet, but I'm strongly considering about starting a position. Well, that's it for today. Let me know what you guys think about the stock in the comments below. Are you buying it? Are you scared of Chinese companies getting delisted? As always, if you found some value watching the video, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.